Hey guys, today is the day. Make sure y'all go vote. Of course, it's going to go up after the voting and the polls are done. But if you did vote, comment down below and tell me you voted. So important. I don't understand why people think voting is not important. You would enjoy all the perks and pleasures of Gordon. Maybe even someday make them by yourself. All with only the most minor of side effects. watching vampire in brooklyn and we just ordered pizza a little chill moment for my mom's birthday since i was in new york um on her actual birthday my brother's birthday is on wednesday i'm gonna get like lit i um with this where you going you know what you want y'all what just happened to me so i went to the post office right and i went in there i had my own like little envelope or whatever because i just keep them in my house now because i'm shipping off wigs all the time and all of that so i just keep it at my house so um i have like some express ones just in case people need it quicker so i brought my little express envelope in there with my bundles and i put the of course it was in there but i walk up to the joint and she like um she was like oh you grabbed the wrong envelope and i'm looking at her like what is you talking about yeah i'm looking at her like what is you talking about how what i grabbed the wrong how you know what i need you know what i'm saying and then i was like no i was like no i didn't i brought this in she was like you know that's one day shipping right i was like yes i know and she was like oh, okay well you know that's expensive are you sure you need that one or whatever she said and i was like yes like do i look broke do i look incompetent like do i look fucking dumb or something like what is wrong with you and this was literally the lady that does the passport she was like she came out of her little door and just started picking on me and i'm like bro you don't go press some passports go send off some applications bitch like dang so um so she just kept doing like kept asking me like little shit basically trying to embarrass me in front of everybody like i didn't know what i was doing the whole time i knew exactly what i was doing i needed one day shipping i needed express mail i knew exactly the envelope that i was using because i picked the shit up so i know exactly what it's used for okay and then she was like do you have a label i was like no that's what i'm in line for and then she was like oh well you could just fill out like one of these little things here so it make it quicker so i was like oh, okay thank you um that was one thing that she helped me with because like um is that a piece of lint or a bug y'all saw that so i went over and i got the little label and then she like like guided some lady over there to like help me with the freaking label like i needed help writing down my information that i know like girl what are you doing like i'm not dumb do i fucking look dumb and it was an older lady and i feel like she did that because i was a younger person and i just really 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 hate that older people really be coming at young people like we don't know what the fuck we doing basically it's just like ask if we need help you know don't insist that we need help don't try to insult us basically like just ask oh do you need help with anything like um do you need any additional information on your shipment or whatever like you know something like that like be polite about it but don't just be like oh you grabbed the wrong one that one's expensive you know are you sure you need that one that one is twenty dollars like i know how much it is bitch it's twenty five dollars and i got that in my pocket like hot girl so it's like I don't understand like why she was just picking on me or whatever I was the youngest person in there but I was just like yo I know what I'm doing and I didn't ask you for help like it would be different if you was like oh do you need help politely and I would be like oh no I'm fine like I got it or if I had any questions I would ask you but don't come at me and just 
try to make it seem like I don't know what I'm talking about like point blank period like I'm just clueless do I look clueless no do I look dumb no do I look broke fuck no I look great okay like please do not try to play me in front of all these people Ugh. but when I got up to the little counter to you know send off my package the guy was nice and he gave me all the information and he was like do you have any questions and I was like oh yeah so then I started asking him about stuff you know like just I felt more he was nicer like you know I felt more comfortable to ask him the questions that I really needed because this bitch over here just being aggressive and not minding her business and not in there doing her job like somebody please come apply for a passport to keep this bitch busy like oh my god sorry y'all my potty mouth but like yo she was getting on my nerves I hate old people like that they do that shit when I go vote too they're like oh you need to walk over I know I vote in the same place every single time I go vote. It's the same process. I already know. I already know. Do not act like, instead of like, you know, acting like it's my first time voting, ask me. Is this your first time voting? If I say no, and then you be like, oh, okay, well, you know what to do. Do you have any questions? Boom. But don't just be like, oh, well, you need to do this. And oh, do you, you need to, um, this is, I got this. I really, I have this, sis. I got this okay don't try to make me look dumb in front of everyone just because i'm young like i'm <laughs> i have knowledge inside of this big old dome under this hat okay <laughs> anyways y'all sorry i'm ranting but that that just really got on my nerves and i want to know if people really deal with that because like i feel like i deal with that all the time and it's just so annoying like so freaking annoying so let me know if y'all deal with that with older people too Ugh. All right, I gotta go. We're at Color Me Mine, and you like pick your um, little things you wanna paint, and then you go over there and you get your paints. Oh yeah. Oh, that's cute. All right, y'all. I don't know what to pick. I had mixed sisters subscribe, subscribe. Oh, thank you, girl. She's telling me to subscribe. Me. Honestly, they have hair brushes, y'all. They are not playing, okay? I don't know. Shot glasses? Okay. Um, I don't know what to pick. But then again, I like this one. I mean, go bigger than my own. Do like a yin yang type thing. Oh, okay. Okay. But don't, don't do black and white. This one color. Like, do like opposite colors. So, like, you I don't like do purple, color. Like so, so, you gotta pick you the colors. So, the number one thing you need to remember is that when you're putting the colors down, you have to put three coats of the same color in order to make it look um, like this. Yes, yeah, see, three coats for the brightest colors. My sister made this one last time. How cool. You can put like a little candle in there, a tea light. She made it for our Aunt Stacy. She's an AKA. Yeah. So I'm doing like this sponging technique with the gray to make it look like marble kind of. So when it bakes, the outside is gonna be black and then the gray part is gonna be like gray marble-ish. Your girl is an artiste. So now I'm adding white to it. So first I did like the gray speckles or whatever. Now I have the white in this little like thing. And I'm just kind of tracing out the shape or whatever so that it makes more sense. Like that is marble. That looks cool. Look at my sisters, y'all. Ah. Z Gallery, what's up? What you want to do? <laughs> Let's talk contracts. <laughs> stacks on stacks on stacks. Stacks on stacks on stacks.
Bus boys. Thank you. tired of seeing this damn hat but listen it's cold and i don't have any hats of my own so um maybe i'll get some hats while i'm in here but yeah i'm at springfield mall and yeah i'm about to go see like what they have i know bath and body works is having a like 4.95 off of minis and i do want a hand sanitizer and some and see what lip gloss that they have um every time i go they're out of the the mentha ones like the mentha peppermint whatever so i'm gonna see if i can find that um your girl's blonde today and yeah so let's go also somebody was like oh my god you're from virginia just like me i was like nah i'm not from virginia baby girl i just like y'all malls like y'all have some of the best malls honestly maryland don't really have any or it's just that like i grew up in those freaking malls like annapolis and like all that and it's just like it's not even exciting to me so i just come here because y'all got more selections in target got some coffee um i'm looking at the home decor because it looks really nice and target always has great stuff but i want to see what candles they have on clearance which is over there so i'm gonna be right back Oh, look at this gold turkey. <laughs> Alright, I'm in the actual candle aisle now. And this smells like my ex-boyfriend. Ew. Um. <laughs> oh, that smells good. It's called Leave Your Worries Behind. This smells like, this is called See the Beauty and Everything. It smells like berries, but also like a, like a fresh berry. Oh my God, it smells good. These are only $5.99 at Target too. This one also, always take the scenic route, route, whatever. This smells like nothing, but it smells good. Actually, no, it smells like, It smells like dog spray. Like, okay, never mind. I gave myself until 2.30 to be out because I wanna be back for all of my deliveries because my Black Friday deliveries, some of them come today. Some of them, well, more of the story, some of them come today. So I'm just hoping that if I miss any, they aren't like signature, like you have to sign for it. So. It's like 2 15 and I'm kind of over it already, so I'm low key about to leave. Look at the decorations, they're so pretty. I love Christmas time. That was a fail. There was nothing in the mall. I was kind of hoping to get like a gift or something. I know you're supposed to do Black Friday shopping, but y'all. 
I'm not with it. Like, I can't be punching people's grandmas and stuff for a Keurig. It's just not happening. Like, uh-uh. So, I'm going to look online because there's still more sales. Like, no sales were over, to be honest. Like, a lot of places extend them. Um, So, I'm going to look online and see what people have. But, there was, like, nothing in the mall. And, you know what? Honestly, I'm a better online shopper. Um, I just... It's easier for me to shop online. Yeah, there's nothing for me here. But you know what? I got out of the house and I look good doing it, okay? Okay? I look good. Sometimes, like, do y'all be shook? Like, sometimes you just look at your friends and you be like, dang, y'all some bad bitches, okay? I'm just saying. Um, Can I turn because I don't know what homeboy doing. It's a stop sign, baby girl. My friends are so bomb. Even my cousins, my family, my sisters, like we are all beautiful as hell. It's actually kind of like scary. Wow. Sometimes you gotta really just like think like that. I mean, even though it's true, <laughs> but this son is disrespectful. Um, but yeah, sometimes I just catch myself like thinking, oh my gosh, my friends are so bomb. My sisters, my cousins, like we're all literally gorgeous. It's crazy. And we all got a good head on our shoulders in that, what? For me, I love positivity. Positivity is just like everything to me. I love when people around me are positive all the time. I mean, we have our times where, you know, sad things happen, but like positivity is such a good thing to be around like overall positive people bruh you need to get some of the people in your life okay it's whoo jesus yes mm -hmm. catching the holy spirit in this freaking driver's seat but yeah y'all i'm headed home i'm gonna end this vlog here i'm not gonna be doing anything today um i might decorate my house i'm not sure but if i do decorate i will maybe put it in a vlog i don't know the extent to what to what we're decorating but um yeah so oh and then my mom's house she wants to decorate too so i might vlog that because that'll be more extravagant and more like fun because she she we like the decorations be lit over there okay as opposed to where i live it's real minimal real dry real okay it's christmas that's it <laughs> so yeah um that'll probably be in the next vlog and what else that's pretty much it make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't already okay become part of the film and yeah i will see y'all in my next video